And not quite so stunning now. Not too bad now, Natalie. Thanks. Yes. We've had some sunshine. We had a, a lot of rain this morning. It did clear quite quickly. It is still windy out there. Comparatively, not as windy as the northwest of England at the moment. But we've still had some quite high gusts, 50 miles an hour quite widely along the coast, inland 40 to 45. So those winds will still be quite strong as we head through the afternoon. Now, Storm Debbie's cleared away. We're left with a fairly unstable westerly flow. So that means sunshine, further showers coming in and still staying quite windy. The wind I think will ease a little bit into the afternoon tomorrow so a brief respite perhaps before potentially this band of rain behind me will come up through Wednesday into Thursday that could give a lot of rainfall some strengthening winds so that's something to keep our eyes on we've got a few showers out there this afternoon not as much rain as this morning and the breeze should throw so should move the showers through quite quickly still though potentially gusting 40 to 50 miles an hour on the coast still with some sunshine and much milder than recent days temperatures for some a good five or six degrees higher than they should be at this time of year now tonight we get some showers pushing in and these showers actually towards dawn could be quite lively coming in from the west a lot of low cloud as well tonight we have actually got a weather warning out for those showers i'll come to that in a minute temperatures not as low as last night down at around nine or ten degrees so these showers could cause some disruption tomorrow they do clear quite quickly but they could be thundery quite a bit of rainfall in the first few hours of the morning then we should see some sunshine the winds ease slightly as we head through the afternoon still breezy but not as noticeable as today and a touch cooler with highs of 13 degrees. Windy for the channel lines, and those winds continue to strengthen overnight, 40 to 50 mile an hour gusts quite widely. Again, there will be more cloud with isolated showers coming in towards dawn. Not a cold night though, with temperatures holding up in double figures. Then we get the showers moving in, dribs and drabs, the main band through the rush hour tomorrow. Again, that could be heavy and thundery, but there will be the risk of further showers following on behind as the day goes on. Still windy, that'll move them through quickly, but they still could be heavy with the risk of some thunder. Plenty of sunshine, though, between those showers and temperatures similar to today. So it's a showery picture as we head through the next few days. We should see a lot of sunshine between them, but it does remain quite windy. The winds do start to ease off for a time as we head in towards Thursday and Friday. And you can see as we get towards the weekend, we start to get a little bit more in the way of mild air coming in. But there'll still be a lot of cloud, still be outbreaks of rain that could be heavy at times. Natalie. Thanks very much indeed, Bea. Thanks. And that's all from us for now. We'll be back with Spotlight at 6.30 here on BBC One. Do have a good afternoon. Thanks for your company. Bye for now.